Michael Darby. Michael Darby is suing Candace from Real Housewives of Potomac between Potomac and Atlanta. Baby, they got the blogs in the news in a tiff. Now, Atlanta been falling short, but they about to make a comeback. I, I, I got a feeling these next couple of years, Potomac and Atlanta is about to have us in a choke hold. Please send me some cameras. Ran Andy, please send me you got your nose out that line. And you sent them cameras up there to Gwinnett County to Drew's house. Please tell me you did. Because if we missing all of this, y'all messing up. Anyway, do y'all remember whew, this past season on Real Housewives of Potomac when Candace alleged that Michael Darby goes to a male escort's house and has oral sex? Well, apparently when that episode aired, Michael sent Candace a cease and desist. The, sh the shit was already caught on camera, so Candace could not take it back, but he expected Candace to make a formal retraction. Now, do y'all believe that Michael Darby really was going to a, es a male escort to get his D sucked? Is this a lawsuit that's even worth pursuing because it's a $2 million lawsuit, except for the fact that Michael, I mean, besides him looking like a creep, he has said on camera that he wanted to suck Juan's D chick. He has been grabbing men's butts around the, uh, around on the show, camera crews, check. He's been called cheating, check. He's been allegedly caught with another man in another country that he wanted to give a Cartier watch to in exchange for sex, kick. So he's already got a history. So I'm just saying when they go to court, it's not going to look too good for him anyway. Now, I know, man, man, I don't know, maybe Ashley talked him into doing this. Do you think Ashley and Michael are still working together to try to take down Candace because Ashley is embarrassed that she was a dummy and didn't get anything in her marriage for being up under somebody that looks like the crib keeper for the last four, five years of her life. And now even though Ashley still got that nice tight face and that nice tight body, she's a waste of a youth because now who's going to take us seriously with two kids by a demon <laughs> by the crib keeper <laughs> who still got keys to a house. <laughs> you might as well go back to fucking that man. We're going to play the clip. Of course we can't show it, but we're going to play the audio just to remind you. <laughs> I've also heard that Chris has been in some other DMs that are not quite as innocuous and innocent Ashley, as mine. Ashley, your Just husband so you know, likes to leave you, do you, do you wanna, and do go you, to a man named uh, house and suck his dick. Oh. <laughs> I'm not joking. <laughs> are you veering off the so, path? So let's not. Is this deflection? Because Chris ain't sucking no dick. <laughs> I'm sick of so my stomach. We sucking the house. We can't do that. <laughs> no. I was not supposed to talk about this 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 person, um, but he says Michael Darby is a client of his. That's what your ass get, because I was holding on to that. You wanted smoke. So, here. You need to watch what you say. I know what I said. You're making shit oh, up. I'm not. So, do y'all believe it's true? Wendy had to put up her lighter after that. Do y'all believe that Michael Darby was really round up with a male escort. Because now if this really goes to court, they got to go to discovery, which means everything is up for grabs. Now you got to prove that Candace is lying and that she had intent to harm you. The lawsuit is for $2 million. Michael has not had $2 million in damages from him sucking off sausage when it's not unfeasible that he would be around here on his knees especially when he want to get on wand so bad now the real tea would be if we ever found out that it was a real it was a real thing between Juan and michael 